And then firstly welcome back to the club. Good to be back. Yeah, great to be back, yeah. Delighted to be back. Back in Dublin. And you thought on tonight's game, unfortunately not the result, but uh, still a good performance. Yeah, I, th I mean I thought we done well considering it's our first competitive game. Um like Liam said wasn't there, we're only three weeks at it, you know, and there's still still a lot of small things we need to uh, improve on and to perfect over the next the next week or so before next week. But you know, we're looking forward to next week and confident to getting a result. Glad to get the number one jersey yourself. Ah well, come here. It's it's not it's not decided yet, you know. Like um, people look at the squad number, but it's it's only a number at the end of the day, you know. Um, you know, happy enough to get the, get the nod tonight, and you know we'll see how training goes during the week, and then Liam will make his decision for next week. You made some important saves near the end of the game to, to keep it at one nil. So you must be pleased with a few of those. No, I mean we've been, myself and Barry have been working hard with Tim. Like it's it's great to first goalkeeping coach I've had in what 18 months, two years now, you know. So it's great to be. Like working with him, he was at past before. Like so, I mean, he's probably the best goalkeeping coach in the country, and he's been working the two of us hard, and he's been giving us a lot of advice. So I mean, that's what we're, that's what we're working on. Looking forward to being playing Russian Park next Monday night as well. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't play in, in the Longford friendly because uh, I played in, in in the Phoenix game then on the Astro. So Liam wanted me to get 90 minutes in on the Astro. So obviously then Barry has to play games as well. So he played in Richmond. But you know, it's, it's great to be back and. I've, I've had a lot of support and a lot of texts off people and they're saying welcome back and that, but, you know, so. Obviously for the supporters, they were looking forward to a competitive game as well at Richmond. And, uh, oh yeah, I'm sure. All they have to play for as well. Yeah, definitely. I mean, we've, we've kept the tie alive. Ideally, we would have liked to, to win tonight, which is what we came to do, but it's only 1-0. Uh, you know, look, looking at the players we have in the squad, we're more than capable of, you know, throwing that around and beating Cliftonville by two goals. So that's what we're aiming to do.